Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the Zuka Pro Artist Makeup Case Review. I'm a makeup artist here in Nashville, Tennessee, and I really needed a new makeup case, so I invested in the $310 Zuka makeup bag. I got mine off Amazon. It kind of hurts to say that it was that much money, but I think it's really worth it um, for the amount of time I've used it. It's really compact, well organized, and it just looks professional when you go on to a job. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get started. So here is my Zuka bag right here. I absolutely love this thing. It's so compact and it keeps a lot of stuff in it. Um, and so here's the button that attaches to the outside and then you just unzip it and all your makeup is stored in here. Very well organized. So I even keep my Tim2 airbrush machine in here and that is a lot. I used to carry around two bags of makeup and that just, it was not working out for me. So what I love about this case is all the pockets, all the zippers, everything, like it, so much stuff can be stored in here. And you move on to these pouches. You get six pouches, one, two, three, four, five. I think I have another one somewhere hiding. I do, I know it. Um, but I love these pouches because they actually come with labels where you can label like foundation, concealers, mascaras, blushes, you know, all that kind of stuff. I haven't done that yet because mine's still pretty new. I love these things. Um, they look small and they're pretty compact, but they hold so much makeup in them. You can stuff this thing a lot more than I have here. Um, and they're very easy to clean. They have the label on the side, like I said, and then they have the Zuka symbol as well. It just looks professional when you lay them out on the table. They also have this little netted pocket up top where I keep my hose for my airbrush machine and my airbrush gun. Um, so that works really well. Um, turning it to the side, they have this little pocket here where you can keep business cards and I keep a lot of my airbrush pods in here. Um, and then you can keep a mirror. As you can see, the metal is pretty sturdy. Um, it seems like it will hold up for a while. They also have some great wheels on this thing that seem really durable. My problem with my last makeup case is the wheels broke down um, and just it just stopped working. It just wasn't great at all. So I love this case. It even has more pockets on the back and you can keep, you know, what do they have in here? Oh. You can put like your name right there and your contact information if you ever lose your bag. Um, I think this bag was created to go through airports um, and be like a carry-on size. So this is great for that. Um, yeah, here's the Zuka packing tips for the airplane. And then there's another pocket here. So here is the handle. You just press the button and it slides right up and you can press it back down. On this side, there is another zipper and another big pocket, and then you have another pocket behind it. There's also a handle here, which is really nice when you're going up the stairs or something like that. Um, and then, what I didn't know about this thing, which I love, is there is actually, you can sit on this, it's a seat. So if your client needs to sit down for a second or um, you need to sit down in the airport or something like that, you can, pop a squat on there. Um, I love, I love this thing. It's really sturdy. I think it holds up to 300 pounds. So this is an awesome case. The only con that I don't love about this case is you don't want to stuff a lot in these pockets because when you go to try to close it, it doesn't really close very well. So that's the only thing that I would change. Maybe, I don't even know, add the pocket on the outside or something like that, but it just doesn't close very well. I keep my cotton balls in here so they're squishy and you can kind of shut them in tight. So overall, I think you guys can tell that I absolutely love my Zuka makeup bag. I hope this video helped you decide whether or not you want it. Um, I think the only con I would say would be the price and would be the pocket in the front that doesn't close very well if you stuff it too much. Um, but other than that, everything else is a pro. I absolutely love the case. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll leave a link down below um, of where you can get the case. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!